somebody who um, went through his um, experiences, and I'm really pleased to that uh, he joined us today, is ha Saeed uh, Kasi Sahat, who is the writer and author of the book. Doctors and many more. 
So hence migration seems to be was migrated to us nothing. Nobody knows us, but today we have our own identity. We, we play a very important role in the British society. Uh, I did uh, interviews of many people in Northwest where I came to know many of the barriers and the problems back in 1960s. Uh, some of the migrants, when they relocated, they did not visit their loved ones back home for 10 years. 10 years is a very long time. It means some of their families died back home, some of the, their kids died back home, some of uh, the migrants who actually migrated to the UK uh, because of their barriers, because of low wages those days, like in the interviews, many of them mentioned they started their life at the age of 9, 10, 12, 13, and today they become very famous to play in the British society. But those days, because of the barriers, because of the low wages, many of them did not travel back home for 10 years, and some of them died here as well. So they, they missed a lot, they sacrificed a lot. That's why I put in this uh, title, what would you sacrifice being an immigrant? Because it's never easy to establish your life, your family life. And nowadays, uh, in the British society, migrants are suffering through many problems. Uh, because of the home office policies and uh, the political uh, situations, it is very difficult to live uh, in the UK nowadays. Uh, the policies are very strict, uh, but they're not considering how important role, uh, how positive role the migrants have played in this country. If I look on the uh, statistics in the in specific in the Northwest, um, you will find 45% of the migrants living in the Northwest. They are from Asia, China, Europe, uh, uh, America, and throughout the world. This is roughly 45%, which means it's a huge uh, society, community, and they are uh, from in their daily life, they are contributing towards the British society, such as they have their own community centers, like the uh, established community center in Liverpool, and they're representing their country, their culture, their color. They have their own identity. The people who started their life with, with no identity, with just one suitcase, like shown in the picture, with uh, zero friends, they're having many friends today, and this is a part, positive contribution of the migrant family towards the British society. Thank you so much.